Okay, welcome to my channel today. In this video, I'm going to walk you through on how to change fonts in a cell mobile application. So, if you are a cell user and you don't have the mobile app, you may think about. I think you continue to get the mobile app on it. It's still okay. So, install it on a smartphone and use the Excel on the go. So, let's get started. I will access the Excel app by swiping up. Then use the final search to get to Excel. Okay, so you know how to access it from your own device. I'll tap on it for it to open. All right, I would like to explain this using a sample. So I uh, we like using the black document. So I'll tap on the plus sign at the top right. Select blank workbook. All right, let me type a few words. Maybe I can say orange. This okay. Mangoes, okay, mango. Uh, which other fruits will I use? Okay, banana. Okay, okay, these are free. So I want to change the the font. I'll tap on the cell that contains the text. Then tap on the ribbon display options command uh, button, which is the arrow icon at the bottom right. Okay then you can see now the calibri is chosen as the default font so i'll tap there then now i have some other fonts i can work with okay maybe i will go with um um amesis mt you can see it has changed this font now to something thicker i can say okay let me change this other font again Note that this thing is done on the home tab, so that's why we have the home here already selected. So it's selected by default. So I'll tap here again, then scroll down to go with another font. Okay, Times New Roman may be down because ST, because that's what most people yeah, like using. Okay, so I can tap on it for it to be selected for that. For the second data. So I can tap and just say, okay, let me just take go with another thing here. So these are just different entries with different uh, font um, type, different fonts, okay? So these are just the steps you have to take to change fonts in a cell mobile app. I hope this video helps. Please do well to subscribe to my channel, like the video, and leave comments.